This monument in Arlon, Belgium, states, I have undertaken the work in the Congo in the interest of civilization and for the good of Belgium. The I here spoken of is King Leopold II. King Leopold II, the longest reigning king in Belgian history. To this day, he is remembered fondly in Belgium as the Builder King for his extensive construction work in Belgium. And also the work undertaken in the Congo is remembered in Belgium in the form of statues, like this one in Blankenbergen, a popular coastal resort. In it, we see two brave Belgian colonists protecting a Congolese mother and child. And this is Leopold's legacy to this date. He is remembered for his construction work in Belgium and his economic and social projects in the Congo. What the monuments don't tell? That during Leopold's ownership, that's right, he owned Congo as a private property, 10 million Congolese have been killed greatly overshadowing the massacre of the Jews during the Second World War. His colonists, portrayed as brave protectors of a Congolese woman and child, would in real life probably taken the child away while sending the mother to a forced labour camp. What about the work in the Congo in the interest of civilization? This civilization entailed the cutting of thousands of hands, those of adult men, but strange enough, also often enough, of women and children. These men, women and children would be mutilated when quota at rubber plantations and diamond mines were not met. But the civilization efforts didn't end just there. Killing, rape and torture were used commonly to subdue the local population. And hunger and decease helped to exacerbate the situation even more. And so when Leopold's private country was officially annexed by Belgium in 1908, the country was in total ruin. King Leopold's legacy of his 13-year rule over Congo Free State is such that his name should have the same stigma as those of Hitler and Pol Pot. Instead, he is remembered and honoured to this day as the Builder King. Well, I for one would definitely think twice before eating one of Belgium's famous Antwerp's hanges. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe and share. Leave a comment and let us know what you'd like the next video to be about.